not gonna lie. I set my alarm at like eight and I was like, oh my God, I'm gonna like get ish done. I'm gonna do so much and just didn't happen. Sometimes our bodies are like, hey girl, I need some sleep, okay? But honestly, I woke up kind of stressed. I woke up, I woke up kind of like, I don't know, feeling some type of way. Excuse my hair, uh, literally, like as you know, I just woke up. Um, don't come at me at the comments. So I was like, you know what? I'm gonna whip out my camera and I'm gonna tell people and show people how to just feel better about this whole situation and how to get out of a rut, a general rut when you're in self-isolation because honestly, being at home is a blessing. Um, as people say, you're not stuck at home, you're safe at home. Sometimes it is still hard. It still gets to you and it's totally fine if it does. I mean, your feelings are valid. There's no reason why you should, you know, feel guilty for feeling a type of way because, I mean, the world is literally going through. <laughs> it's going through it right now. I was like, you know what, I'm gonna just show people what I do when I'm feeling this way. Um, this might not really relate to you or you might have a completely different routine or whatever, but I hope it just inspires you to just get up, get dressed, or it gives you some type of entertainment because that is great too. Now, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna make my bed because honestly making my bed, I do it every day. I'm not even gonna lie. I'm not trying to like flex. <laughs> I make my bed every day. Um, but it's true, I make my bed every day. Um, I don't know if it's like the fear of my mom yelling at me or I just feel better. Um, I think it's more so that it just makes me feel like, okay, you know what? Made my bed, that is a sign. It's time to start my day. Let's take it second month, minute by minute, okay? So I put on my Sunday's best. Um, I don't even know what that means. What does Sunday's best mean? It's a song. Like I should. <laughs> But I put on this workout outfit. I usually, if I'm feeling very unmotivated, I usually will actually put on an actual outfit. Um, but I'm also feeling unmotivated to work out today. And I know today is a day where I just want to move my body. I want to feel something. And so I was like, you know what? I'm more likely to work out if I'm already in my workout clothes. I discovered guys that it has a thing for your phone <gasps> that literally changes my whole life like <laughs> this is amazing something that gets me like really excited to get up in the morning is to have a good breakfast or like my favorite breakfast i have been loving making banana pancakes from blogilates like she made a really short video one day on her instagram on how to make banana pancakes and i have been <laughs> I'm gonna turn into a banana pancake.
to take care of something every day. Obviously, we take care of Shasta, which is our cat. Um, but it's nice to care for something and see something grow. Like, I got so excited when this one, oh my gosh, this plant was dying. And then we planted her in this really cute, so cute, this cute pot from Urban Outfitters. And she just started blossoming. She started growing. And it's like, it's incredible she, she literally came back to life because you know just how you take care of yourself you know it's nice to water these plants too now it is coffee time um i love making my cup of you know my cafecito my coffee time is just mm, very special to me i've been really into my iced lattes you know they're so good, um, but I've been making them here at home. So I just pop her in, and then what I do is when the coffee comes out, it comes out hot, so I just put it in the fridge, or if I want to speed up the process a little bit, I put it in the freezer and just like pour it over ice and then add like my creamer and stuff, and it is so good. This whole vlog has been me in the kitchen. <laughs> um, I mean, what can I say? Food makes me happy. Coffee makes me happy. Guys, this coffee is so good. I'm telling you, that Nespresso changed my life. I know I'm in workout clothes because I'm, like I said, I'm going to be working out a little bit later, but I caught a glimpse of my under eye bags this morning in the mirror so i was like let me let me do something like i know i'm gonna be working out um but just like something like eyebrow gel can you know spruce it up a little bit or um usually when i'm feeling like bleh and like i'm gonna be working out or you know, I obviously I'm not wearing like full face of makeup these days, but what I really like doing is my brows and then I throw on some chapstick. Can you guys hear how congested I am from this pollen? Guys, I haven't even I haven't even gone outside today. Like I don't understand. Like how does it how does it come in? No entiendo, no entiendo. <laughs> and then what really does it is the cloud paint. Uh, from Glossy. I love this stuff. It's so good. talk to you about some tips and some things that I've been doing to just kind of keep my productivity as high as I can at the moment obviously it's things are weird it's really hard to function at a normal level for some people or function at all when everything is happening obviously people are in different situations there's people who have lost a family member because of this or people who have um, who have to take care of a family member so their entire life is on hold or just a bunch of different reasons but things that have been helping me are or is my bullet journal I 
I could just talk endlessly about this thing, why I love it so much. It's literally changed the way I work. Um, it's just, it's amazing. So if you're wondering which bullet journal I have, I have the one from Archer and Olive and oh my gosh, it's just changed my freaking life. Um, let me quickly explain. If you don't know what a bullet journal is, I'm well aware that not everyone knows what it is. Uh, so basically a bullet journal is a blank journal. This is how, how I would define it. It's a blank journal. Typically uh, people like to use the ones that are dotted and essentially you make it what you want it to be. So some people use it more as like a journal where they um, like write out their thoughts and their feelings and their moods and their hopes and their dreams. But for me, I like to use it for productivity. So what I do is every single, uh, every single month I have a theme and this is like my favorite part. If you're looking for inspiration, you can look to my sister, actually, a little plug. Um, my sister is an incredible artist, illustrator. She has like the cutest drawings. Um, I'm telling her to make more bullet journal videos. Or obviously the queen is Amanda Rachley. She's the best, she's the bomb. Honestly, I've been watching her for forever and she's actually the one who got me into bullet journaling. So, you the real MVP. Um, but this month you can see I made my own little um, calendar and here obviously I just use it as a regular calendar I'll write anything obviously there's not a lot going on this month as you can see um, but I'll just like write things that are happening this month and here is where I write just like basically all of the to do's that I have uh, for every single day so it's really fun. I really like it because you can really just track your habits. You can make a habit tracker. You can make all that. So many, so many things. The possibilities are endless. What I like to do is every night before I go to sleep, not every night, but I try, um, I'll write what I need to do the next day because I feel like I'm more likely to get up at a certain time. I'm more likely to just like get cracking when I know exactly what I'm supposed to be doing for the day. Um, so for today, what I'm actually doing is so today I'm looking for more jobs there's not a lot of jobs in if you're wondering what I'm doing um, I'm in UX user experience design or product design and I'm looking for jobs that are for like entry-level junior level early professionals because I don't have much experience in UX design so that's what I'm doing there's not a lot of entry-level positions open right now so I'm just trying to see what I can find I'm trying to organize basically organize the stuff on my computer into folders so when I hopefully fingers crossed get an interview people will be like oh my god can I see more information about this and I'll be like girl can you see more information about this I got you and yeah that's really all I can do right now because I have applied to feels like everything available for UX early UX designers in Atlanta um, that really helps me to just plan the night before because I get kind of excited about the things that I need to do you know just think of it differently just be like you know what I'm excited that I have the chance to be looking for jobs you know I'm excited that I have that I'm in this cool new field of UX design and it's like super futuristic and really cool to be designing digital products and stuff so it helps to have a different mentality. I should probably get back to doing stuff. I'm working from home. <laughs> Say hi to my vlog. What up? How Say who? Everybody? Say who you are. Who are you? Business person. What's your name? Tony. I feel like I'm introducing like a little kid. Like, what's your name? Say hi. Procrastinate working out any longer because I know the longer I wait the less I'm gonna 
feel like doing it. Um, but I actually feel, you know, I'm feeling ready. I'm feeling motivated. I actually made up my own, I wrote it in my phone, so I made up a completely just like random mix of cardio moves and ab moves and I'm doing it, there's seven moves and I'm gonna do it four rounds. Each round is seven moves and I'm gonna do that four times if that makes sense. And that'll be like 30 minutes, I think. I'm gonna put some music on and just kind of taking them around my day. They've seen a lot. It is very late now. It's like 11. Oh my gosh, it's midnight. Please excuse my hair. I just took a shower and I didn't wash my hair and I kind of wish I did wash my hair because what is this? Um, anyways, um, yeah, the movie was so cute. We watched All the Boys Part 2 and it was really cute. I really hope that this gave you a little bit of inspiration, a little bit of motivation to just get outside or just to hang out with your fam, do something fun. Um, obviously, I know a lot of people are working and can't, but if you can take just a second to just slow down um, or just even if it helps to just change the way you work because obviously a lot of people are working from home now um, But yes, I hope that it helped you or at least gave you a little bit of a distraction From everything that's happening in the world right now because it's literally crazy um, But I'm just gonna wash my face brush my teeth go to sleep Hopefully have a good day tomorrow. I think it's gonna be really sunny tomorrow, which I'm really excited about um, but I'll see you in my next video. Thanks for watching. Bye!